Good morning, Miami-Dade Bike Friendly Summit participants. I'm Bill Nesper, Interim Executive Director of the League of American Bicyclists. And on behalf of the League, I'm very happy to welcome you to the Miami-Dade Bike Friendly Summit. I'm very sorry that I can't be with you today as I'm stuck here in Washington, DC, thanks to Winter Storm Stella. The League's Bicycle Friendly America program is essential in accomplishing our mission to build a bicycle friendly America for everyone. The Bicycle Friendly America program has recognized the achievements of over 400 communities, 1,300 businesses, and over 150 universities and colleges across the United States. Being bike friendly is all about making life better for your residents, customers, employees, and students. Even those that don't receive the Bicycle Friendly Community or Business or University designation the first time get useful feedback and a roadmap for success. The key to success in the Bicycle Friendly programs is collaboration. From your summit agenda today, it looks like the Miami-Dade Transportation Planning Organization has brought together a variety of committed partners and Bicycle Friendly Award winners as well, like Max Cycle and Fitness, Florida's only gold bicycle friendly business and the city of Miami, which is a bicycle friendly community at the bronze level and the University of Miami, which is a bicycle friendly university at the bronze level. It's easy to see how a bicycle friendly business that is near a bicycle friendly university in a bicycle friendly community are going to be more successful than one that is trying to go it alone. Working with your agency partners also helps them meet their goals for increasing safety, economic development, improving health, while reducing traffic deaths, congestion, and obesity. I hope you enjoy this beautiful day at the Vizicaya Museum and come away with a commitment to be more bike friendly. Thank you all very much.